just want to talk about Tom right now. He's been a really big influence on me ever since I first joined this church as a sophomore. Probably the main ones that have impact, I thought, were uh, primarily our small group leaders, such as Eric. He's a great guy. He's, he's really funny. And he's really showed me Christ in many different ways. And, uh, you know, he really just shows God's love by, you know, not just making a Sunday morning thing. He'll, you know, every Wednesday we'd meet up and he'll, you know, talk to us about Christ or just about whatever we wanted. I just want to say a few words about Sarah Masters. Um, she's been a wonderful rock in my life and um, in the life of many other girls here. Casey has really impacted my life because she was the first leader I met at Cedar Run Community Church and she started a small group with my friends and I and um, she always made an effort to hang out with us. She's always been that older sister that I never had, um, just always giving me her time, always, whenever I need her, she's always there. I don't have any problems that I can't talk to her about and I see Christ through her. It really just makes an impact on the middle school. And I'm so lucky to have her in my life and I can't wait for all the great times that we're going to have in the future. Uh, the leader that I want to talk about is Phil Covert. Uh, the past four years, Phil's had a really big impact on me. One leader I want to talk about is Kim Pasca. She's been such a great um, influence on me and just um, really been a great leader. I guess he's just kind of seen me grow over the last four years and kind of helped me with everything, ups and downs, like with Christ, and uh, he's taught me a lot of things. And she really helps strengthen our relationship by um, making us go to small group early on Friday mornings before school. But overall, he's a great guy and I've learned a lot from him. I really appreciate everything he's done for me. And just really um, has showed Christ's love to us and has been such a great influence to us. Over the past six years, Bruce has shown me how to be a real man of Christ and I really appreciate the example he set for me and everyone else in the youth group. Katie Von Cullis is actually one of the first leaders I met at Wildlife. Um, she was there my seventh grade year and she made me feel so welcome at my first club. You know, I'm going to miss him as I go away to college, but I know that when I come back, he'll be there for me and always be praying for me and supporting me. TJ Covert taught me, like, more about being a person. It's not a one-time thing. Like, she's not just going to meet you and that's it. Like, she's going to pursue you. He really, like, taught me about God and, like, ways that, you know, he works through you. Uh, one of the most inspirational leaders, I think, is Brad Schoolfield because he inspired our small group that we meet every Friday. Stuff that I was struggling with, like she also struggled with, so she was easy to relate to for me. And someone you could call at like 3 o'clock in the morning and you wouldn't care. Yeah, so I mean, he was really probably one of the most inspirational leaders that I've had. 